Hi, I'm Coach Adam Weingarten, head football coach of the Auburn High School Tigers. Here at Auburn City Schools, we're one big team and one big family. We're so thankful for you and all your support to the 2015 football season. And it's going to take you and all of us in Auburn City Schools for us to have a great, successful 2016 season. Today, we're here to discuss with you what our theme is for next football season, which is the word rise. It's about raising our expectations in every part of our life. At the end of the day, every one of us are here to do great things. You were born and put on this earth for one reason, because you have a chance to be special. We expect our players and we expect you to live with great habits. At the end of the day, what you do most is who you are. And your habits in every area of your life determine what your future is. We expect our players to be their best in the community, with their friends, in school, and on the athletic field. Today, we're going to have several players discuss this word rise with you in hopes that you will join us in this mission to be our very, very best. Hi, I'm Ted Wages, number 42 for the Auburn High Tigers. We have three keys in our program. The first one, education. It's important to get a good education. That's why you're at school. That's why you get to play football. Football only lasts you four, five, maybe six years, but an education lasts you a lifetime. It's important to rise to the expectation in the classroom, to listen to your teachers and administrators. In the classroom, everybody's best is different. It could be A's, it could be B's, or it could be C's. But it's important that you do your best in everything you do. You were born for great things, so be great in the classroom. Hi, I'm Trey Reynolds, number 73. I'm here to talk about second thing, being coachable. Being coachable is not only listen to your coaches, but also listen to your teachers, parents, and administration. These adults have been our age before and are experts in their fields. If you listen to them, they will help you be successful. They have a blueprint for your success, and if you don't listen to them, uh, it will only hurt you. These people care about you and only want your best. So rise, become better listeners, and be coachable in all areas. Hi, I'm number 21, Trayshawn Floyd, and I play for Auburn High School Tigers. The third and final thing we're going to talk about is being a great teammate. Being a great teammate refers to helping out your teammates inside the weight room, on the football field, but also it refers to helping out inside the classroom. You can be a great teammate, but also be a great leader. In certain expectations, we're taught to rise to the occasion of being a great teammate all around the community, in the area we help out. Also, being a great teammate refers to just, just being true to yourself and who you are. Being around great people all, all the time, and you just gotta rise. Also, another part of being a great teammate, you are who you hang around. You are your own habits that we create. So it's about who you hang around. So if you hang with people who do bad things, you're, you're known to follow in their footsteps. But if you hang around people who are known for doing good things, you're, you're going to tend to rise to the occasion that they do. And you're going to follow in the right direction. And they stay there. Hey, I'm Brooks Fuller, number 14 and quarterback for your Auburn High School Tigers.
Today you've heard from three of our guys about the keys to success in our football program. In PE, you'll be receiving this really cool wristband that says Auburn Football 2016 along with the phrase, Rise and Demand Excellence. Every day you have a choice to demand excellence out of yourself in every aspect of life. We are one family, so please join us in Rise. Remember, you are here for special things. Thank you for your time. We appreciate you and look forward to this upcoming football season. Go Tigers!